Oh yeah, so it is this guy on the left. The, that's the one that I initially turned on and you can hear that sound again. So that's gonna drive me crazy. So both light in, your boy's gonna reach out to you. But like I said, if you're watching this, uh, let me know uh, what I need to do to get this uh, alleviated. Um, that sound is not gonna cut it. Super annoying. But man, having white moving head, oof, these look so amazing. So amazing. So I always say I'm not handy, I'm solution driven. And the reason why I was making an audible sound is because the screw here was out and it wasn't screwed in. So I know this probably voided the warranty. I opened the top of my uh, newly bought moving head. See, that's the top. And I'm trying to figure out how to get a screw here so that I can screw this thing in. Um, I don't know if you can see that, but the screw is out on all, let's see, just two of them, not, not all three or four of them, just two. But when the moving head moved, it would go into it. And then uh, that's the sound that we were hearing. So I'm here trying to fix it, trying to be solution driven, but this is unacceptable for a new light. So I know this is not gonna be the norm, but goddamn. <laughs> I know some of you are going to say why not just send it back but this is one of the the risk of dealing with uh, a company from far away as China is that I'm pretty sure when you call them they're going to ask you to do exactly what I'm doing now which is basically just to try to solve the problem yourself in the beginning I know the risk of dealing with overseas companies. Here I am figuring out a solution to this and I think this is gonna this is gonna work. Hopefully these don't pop back out. But I've got one in so far. This one is in. I gotta get the others in and then we'll see how they move afterwards. How this one moved. The other one is fine. So I've screwed them in but I'm not confident that those screws will stay where they are. Uh, I'm pretty sure they're gonna pop back out. Again, I don't know if you can see the screws, but yep, uh, this is uh, this is what we get. So I'm gonna put everything together. Crazy thing is, I actually got a you hear that a screw inside this little thing here. So I'm gonna have to figure out how to get that screw. So. The saga continues, definitely disappointing because uh, I was super excited to get these going. These are still fantastic, but kind of rain on the parade a little bit. All right, folks, I think I have it fixed. I am just not confident in that fix being long-term. The screws don't look like they engage and I feel like they're just gonna come loose. The problem is the screw comes out and the moving head can't move. So let's give it a test. We'll see whether or not, you know, my fix worked. Basically the screw shouldn't interfere with the movement at all. So without further ado, let's test it out. Yes, sir, a lot smoother. I think I'm gonna have to invest in a small screwdriver. <laughs> I just wanna make a statement as far as my experience. You know, a lot of the, the things that we have and get comes from China. So they do manufacture a lot of the lights and the uh, speakers that we have. Both Lighting is a reputable company. Shout out to my guy Rick Reb. I'm sure they sell hundreds of lights. I just happen to be one of the unlucky ones that got something like this. You know, I have a little bit of a following, so hopefully one of you guys who know Rick can show him this video. We can get a great solution going and I can come back to you guys and we'll tell a good story. All right, 
Lavish Life DJ Peck. Peace. This is going to be an example of whether or not we're going to get good service from China. <laughs>